get prepared, get ready. It will do wonders in our midst. And uh, you will be the first partaker in the name of Jesus. I say you will be the first partaker in the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. Um, we started praying the God that answers prayer last week. And I, it was so powerful. And I said we come back uh, today to continue it. That is what we are going to do, but it's taking another dimension entirely. The moment I came back from office, I've been out for throughout the whole week, and uh, the moment I came back this evening, pa, it just showed me, the logo opened my eyes, and I saw that while, while we are changing it a little bit tonight, it's because of that revelation. The Lord opened my eyes and I saw a grief. I mean it. I'm not saying this to scare us, but we know that I'm not, uh, I don't give prophecy or revelation to scare people. I don't do that. Even the one that is happy, say, I won't tell you, I'll just tell you, praise the Lord, let's begin to rejoice. Amen. I saw grief and uh, I, was, I was meditating on tonight when God opened my eyes to see that. And it does disappear. Immediately I know God want, God is passing a message. Hear me, say, hear me, man. There is a covenant of preservation of my life. I can see it. I am sure. You know when you are sure of something? Before I gave my life to Christ. When I gave my life to Christ. That was. Before I gave my life to Christ. That was the covenant that which God gave me. That I should come and work for him. And he said that is what we back it up. Covenant of preservation. And not only me, for everything, ev I don't, I mean it, everything that will be under my care, that covenant will be upon them. That covenant will be upon them. <coughs> so I tell us, on this platform, nothing will, ca will devil will never, never ca ca catch us on our way. How it happened, we do not know. No. God no beginning, no the end. So as a devil is planning it, as our enemy are planning it, God, the God that is the brain, the power behind the, this ministry, will begin to expose them. You know, they have not carried it out. They are just trying to plan it. As they are planning it, God will expose them. And you know, the moment God exposed them, you know the meaning. It means that thing has been destroyed. So hear me, sir, hear me, man. Every member of this ministry, I lie not in the Holy Ghost, every member of this ministry, there's preservation of life upon us. There's preservation of life upon our spouse and children. So no one under my watch will die. I'm saying it. No one, because I'm a watchman. Watching over lives. So no one under the care of this ministry will die. And none of our children. No, that one is that one is said to none of our children. Even if they go outside the will of God for them to die there, God will punish them and bring them back. Amen. So tonight we are taking part two of it. The God that answer prayer. And uh, it will be uh, subtitled Victory over the grave. Victory over the grave. Whatever grave that the enemy is digging for any one of us, whatever the great grave of hell that the enemy is digging for our home, for our life, for our marriage, for our business, for our career, for our spouse, for our children, the Lord, by the blood of Jesus, is going to grant us victory tonight in the name of Jesus. Hear this. When God answers by fire, death will be defeated. When we call unto the God that answers by fire, and he answer us by fire. Death will be defeated. So tonight, hear me, sir, hear me, man. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, that death, that program death, that uh, vision of death, that dream of death, heaven will cancel it in the name of Jesus. A lot of scripture, I will give it to us as usual so that on our own we can go through them. But we only read uh, two or three. But let's take this scripture down. 
Job 16, verse 18. Job 16, verse 18. Psalm 49, verse 15. Psalm 49, verse 15. Hosea 13, 14. Yes, the gods that answered by fire. He answered by fire. And when he answered by fire, great death will be defeated. Hosea 13, 14. Psalm 88, verse 11. Psalm 118, verse 17. Psalm 118, verse 17. Ezekiel 18, 32. Ezekiel 18, 32. Any woman online, any one of you, any one of you, any woman, any mother, any, what I'm saying woman is this, you are a mother, you are a woman, you are a wife, you are a woman, any woman, any one of you, my answer, that the enemy want to naked you, the Lord will frustrate them in the name of Jesus, the Lord will frustrate them, the Lord will frustrate them. Any power that is not happy with you and want to naked you, they want to naked you. You know the meaning of naked is not this uh, physical body. Eh? What is what what God has given to you as glory, as honor, and they want to they want to rubbish it. The Lord will frustrate them in the name of Jesus. No, we won't allow it. We won't take it. Ezekiel eighteen thirty two. Ezekiel 18, 32, John eleven twenty six, John eleven twenty six, Revelation 21, verse 4, Revelation 21, verse 4, John 10, 10, <coughs> John 10, 10, Third John 1 and 2, <coughs> Third John 1 and 2, Psalm 23, verse 4, Psalm 23, verse 4, John 3, 16. John 3, 16. Job 16, 18. Psalm 49, verse 15. Hosea 13, verse 14. Psalm 88, verse 11. Psalm 118, verse 17. Ezekiel 18, 32. Ezekiel 18, 32. John 11, 26. John 11, 26. Revelation 21, verse 4. Revelation 21, verse 4. John 10, 10. John chapter 10, verse 10. Third John 1 3. Third John 1 3. That means 3 John 1 and 2. 1 chapter 1 verse 2. Third John chapter 1 verse 2. Psalm 23 verse 4. John 3 16. Let's take. Okay, I will take them random. Job 16 18. Job 16 18. The first part of it said, O art, cover not thou my blood. O art. Everybody, please, wherever you are, as you are looking at them, we'll be declaring it. Look at the ground where you are now. Point to the ground. Say, oh, art. Say, you not cover my blood. You know, our life is in our blood. So when the Bible is saying, oh, art, cover not my blood, it simply means cover not my life. So which means you are, no one, no power, no principality, no rulers of darkness will bury you. No one, no power, no principality of darkness will bury your spouse or your children. Are you hearing me? Point your hand to the heart. Say, O oh, art, O oh, art, O oh, art, hear the word of the Lord. Cover not thou my blood. Say, O oh, ye art, you will not cover my blood. You will not swallow my blood. You will not drink my blood. You will not cover my blood. You will not cover the blood of my loved one, my wife, my children, every member of this ministry. Say, O oh, ye art, you will not cover our blood. You will not cover our blood. You will not cover our blood. You will not swallow us. You will not cover our blood. You will not swallow us. You will not cover our blood. You will not swallow us. You will not cover our blood. You will not swallow us. You will not cover our blood. Please put your hand. We, no prayer have started. Put your hand to the earth. Begin to speak to the earth. Oh earth. Oh earth. Oh earth. You will not cover my blood. You will not cover the, the blood of my loved one. My husband. My wife. My children. Mention them. Say you will not cover our blood. In the name of Jesus. You will not cover our blood. In the name of Jesus. You will not cover our blood. In the name of Jesus. You will not cover our blood. Oh art, oh art, oh art. You will not cover our blood. 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 In Jesus' name we have decreed. Psalm 49, 15. Psalm 49, 15. 
He said, God will redeem our soul from the power of the grave. That God will redeem our soul, our life, your soul, ma, your soul, the soul of your children, the soul of your loved one, your husband, your wife. We, God will redeem them from the power of the grave. Say in the name of Jesus, still point your hand to the earth. Say in the name of Jesus, say by the blood of Jesus, say that Lord will redeem my soul from the power of the grave. Say that Lord will redeem the soul of my spouse, my wife. You mention the name of your husband or your wife. If you are a woman, mention the name of your husband. If you are a man, you mention the name of your wife. Are you hearing me? Say in the name of Jesus, say, O oh God, by the blood of Jesus, we redeem my soul from the power of the grave. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say the Lord will redeem the soul of my spouse. Olushola Ariola. Thank you for mentioning my wife's name. You take it again. When I mention my wife's name, you mention your wife or your husband's name. Are you hearing me? Point your hand to the heart. Say in the name of Jesus. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say the Lord will redeem the soul of my wife. Olushola Ariola from the power of the grave. Say my wife. Olushola Ariola. The Lord will redeem your soul from the power of the grave. Say you will not die in the name of Jesus. The earth will not swallow you. The earth will not swallow you. The earth will not swallow you. The earth will not cover your blood in Jesus' name. Point your hand to the earth again. Say, O ye earth, you will not swallow my children. Say that Lord will redeem the soul of my children from the power of the grave in the name of Jesus. Jesus' name. Hosea 13, 14. The next scripture, Hosea 13, 14. Hosea 13, 14. I will ransom them from the power of the grave. I will ransom. I will ransom. I will buy them back. I will deliver them from the power of the grave. From the power of the grave. Point your hand to the earth. That is, you know, that is why we have the grave. The grave is not in the atmosphere, it's in the earth. So point your hand to the grave. Say in the name of Jesus. Say by the blood of Jesus. I have been ransomed. I have been ransomed. Say I have been delivered. I have been set free from the power of the grave. Say by the blood of Jesus. My spouse. My wife. You mentioned the name of your spouse now. Say my spouse. You have been ransomed. You have been delivered from the power of the grave in the name of Jesus. Now you mention your children. Say today, say by the blood of Jesus. Say my children, I've been ransomed. I've been delivered. I've been set free from the power of the grave in the name of Jesus. Say tonight, say my life, my soul, my spouse's soul, my children's soul, my family's soul. I've been delivered. I've been ransomed from the power of the grave in Jesus' name. I say in Jesus' name, Psalm 11817. Psalm 11817. We have not prayed. We are just looking at the scripture. <laughs> Amen. Somebody say this one, God. This just declaration eh, is, is, is prophetic. Psalm 118, What do we have there? Who oh, is going to read it? Say, I shall not die, but live to declare the goodness of God. Point your hand to the earth. Say me or Elua. I want you to touch your chest, you know, with boldness. When you are sure of something and you know you have power over it, you beat your chest. So I want you to show to tell devil, eh? Tell devil with all authority in Christ. Show him. Say in the name of Jesus. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say I will not die, but live to declare the goodness of God in the land of the living. Say, I, or Elua, you see, I'm beating my chest. I want you to beat your chest with all boldness. Say, I, or Elua, Ariola. Say, I declare, I decree, I legislate it, that I shall not die, but live to declare the goodness of God in the land of the living. Say, I will not die in the name of Jesus. My wife will not die. My children will not die. Jesus' name we are praying. Last uh, scripture, let's look at one before we pray. Oh, um, Ezekiel 18, 32. Ezekiel 18, 32. Ezekiel 
18.32 For I have no pleasure in the death of Oreolua that died, said the Lord God. Wherefore, I turn, wherefore, turn yourself and live. Turn yourself, live ye. Turn yourself and live. God is saying, didn't he have pleasure that enemy should kill me now? Every one of you on our online church, this is what God is saying about you. This is what God is saying about your children. God is saying, there is no pleasure in you, in your loved one, in your husband, in your children to die now. So God is saying, turn and live. Did you hear me? Turn and do what? Turn and do what? Hey, um, uh, Mami Kofo, what is God telling you and your children and your family? Turn and, turn and, turn and, uh, uh, my friend's mommy from uh, South Africa. Amen. What is God saying about all my friends? Turn and, turn and, turn and. Please, everybody, I want us to write that scripture down. Ezekiel 18.32. Ezekiel 18.32. Ezekiel 18. God, said, God is saying he has no pleasure that we should die. So God is telling us, wherever we are, we should turn and live. We should turn and live. Every one of us, we shall not die a gruesome death in the name of Jesus. We shall not be manipulated unto death in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lift up. Let's take this uh, four or five declaration before we pray. Lift up your right hand. You know, when you go to court and you want to son or an affidavit, they will ask you to lift up your hand. Am I right? So lift up your right hand. These are, these are your declaration. Eh? You are, you are declaring it. And the Bible says, as, as you have declared, you have said in my ear, so will I do. So lift up your right hand. Say in the name of Jesus. Say I declare that I shall not end this year. That my life will not end this year. That the life of my loved one will not end this year. Say this year, my life will not end with you. My children will not end with you. My wife will not end with you. My husband will not end with you. Say good things in my life will not end this year in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. Say I declare, I declare that I, Orelu Ariola, say this year, say I reject, I reject regret. I reject sorrow. I reject shame. I reject sickness. I reject paralysis. Say I reject accident. Say I reject money. I reject prison. I reject debt. I reject wailing. I reject lamentation. I reject reproach. I reject losses. I reject failure. And I reject grief. Lift up your hand again. Say in the name of Jesus. Say this year. Say I will not. Say I. When you say I, you mention your name. Say I. Or I will Say I will not end this year. Say my life will not end. In regret. Say my life will not end in sorrow. My life will not end in tears. My life will not end in shame. My life will not end in sickness. My life will not end in accident. My life will not end in prison. My life will not end in debt. My life will not end in lamentation. My life will not end in regret. My life will not end in reproach. My life will not end in losses. My life will not end in grief this year. In the name of Jesus. The third time, lift up your hand. Say this year. Say, I will not end this year. Year 2022. In regret. I will not end this year in sorrow. I will not end this year in tears. I will not end this year in weeping. I will not end this year in lamentation. I will not end this year in shame. I will not end this year in paralysis. I will not end this year in wheelchair. I will not end this year in sickness. I will not end this year in accident. Say, I will not end this year in mourning. I will not end this year in prison. I will not end this year in debt. Say, I will not end this year in reproach. Say, I will not end this year in losses. Say, I will not end this year in failure. I will not end this year inside grief. 
so shall he be. In Jesus' name we are praying. Psalm 23, verse 4. Psalm 23, verse 4. Thank you, Jesus. Psalm 23, verse 4. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. Say, I will fear no evil. Say, the remaining days this year, the remaining days of my life, say, I will not fear evil. Say, no evil will come near me. Say, I will fear no evil. Say, for the Lord God is with me. Say, thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. They guide me. They protect me. Can you take it again? Say, in the name of Jesus, Say the remaining days this year. Say the remaining days of my life. Say though I walk through the valley of shadow of death. Say I will fear no evil. For the Lord is with me. Say the rod and the staff. They comfort me. They guide me. They protect me. And they shield me. In Jesus name. As you have decreed and declared so shall I be in the name of Jesus. Hear me sir. Hear me man. In case you are online, in case you are listening to me, you have any some of this, uh, any of this dream or death-related dream tonight by the blood of Jesus. Everyone cancel it in the name of Jesus. Any prophecy of death, any revelation of death, any dreams of death, any fear of death that anyone is having or people are having against you, about you, your loved one, your husband, your wife, your children. Today, by the blood of Jesus, that dream of death, that prophecy of death, that revelation of death, that fear of death, heaven can sue them in the name of Jesus. Heaven can sue them in the name of Jesus. When somebody is dreaming and is seeing dead relative, dead people, is seeing grave, is seeing coffin, there's a spirit of death around. When they cut off the head of a man, the spirit of death is around the corner. When you see a tree, and they are cutting it or they are trying to uproot the tree. The spirit of death is around the corner. When you have a dream and you are playing with dead people, you are in the midst of dead people, you are eating with dead people, you are playing ball with dead people. Amen. Dead people are talking and you are you are talking with them. Ah, it's not for you in the name of Jesus. When you begin to hear strange dream, strange voice on the physical, not in the dream, on the physical. You are hearing some people talking, and when you look around, there's nobody, but you are sure you are hearing them. Amen. When you, some people, you know, the art, the art of a special odor. When you take the sand and you smell it, there's a special odor from this from the art. When you are smell, you are not you, you are you are not holding sand, but you are perceiving the odor of the art. You are perceiving the odor of blood. You are not. Medical people, you are not in the hospital, you are not carrying blood, and you are just perceiving blood around you. Or you are smelling from, I think, is it not formalin? You are smelling formalin. Is it formalin? Medical people, please, so that uh, my people online will not say, ah, already not know the correct name. That chemical that they use in preservation of uh, dead, uh, dead people, dead um, animal, I think it's formalin. You are smelling it. You are in your house. You are smelling formalin. You are in your house, your office. You are smelling grief. Or you are smelling, uh, what do you call it? Embalmment. Where they embalm people. What's the name of the place? Where they embalm people. You are smelling the place. You know, that place always smells so thick like formalin. Amen. All these are sign that the spirit of death is around the corner. But hear me. Every one of us on this platform, I decree, I declare, by the mandate of God upon this ministry, by the covenant of preservation, every dream, every agenda, every proposal of death over any one of us or our loved one, heaven can sue them in the name of Jesus. Heaven can sue them in the name of Jesus. Heaven can sue them in the name of Jesus. Let's lift up our hand and begin to plead the blood of Jesus upon ourselves. The blood of Jesus. Begin to plead the blood of Jesus upon yourself, upon your spirit, soul, and body. You mention the name of your husband, your wife. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus upon myself, my husband, my wife, my children. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. 
the blood of Jesus, the blood of Jesus. Plead the blood of Jesus upon your spirit, soul, and body, upon your life, the life of your loved one. The blood of Jesus, 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 the blood of Jesus. Jesus' name we are praying. Say in the name of Jesus, say any power, calling my name from the grave, say die. They should just die because you are not going to die and somebody must die. So that power must die. Are you hearing me? Say in the name of Jesus, say any power, calling my name from the grave, say in the name of Jesus, die, 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 die. Any power calling the name of my wife. Any power calling the name of my children. Any power calling our name on this platform, on this ministry. Any power calling the name of this ministry from the grave. You that power. In the name of Jesus. Die, 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 die. Any power calling your name, calling the name of your children from the grave. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus. Command them to die. Command the power to die in the name of Jesus. Any power that is calling the name of your loved one, the name of your children, the name of your work from the grave, command them to die in the name of Jesus. Die, 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 die. In Jesus' name they die. Say every influence of the grave of graveyard spirit over my life. Influence of graveyard spirit. Every environment have spirit assigned to them. They are spirit assigned to graveyard. So when they have influence upon a man, it's so, it's so terrible. Say in the name of Jesus, say every influence of graveyard spirit over my life, over the life of my wife, over the life of my children, over this ministry, over every one of you, say in the name of Jesus, should that influence die, 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 die. Die, Command the influence to die. In the name of Jesus. Any influence of graveyard spirit over your life, over your home, over your marriage, over your business, over your career. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus, command them to die. Influence of graveyard over your life. Command them to die. In the name of Jesus, command them to die. In the name of Jesus, command them to die. In the name of Jesus, command them to die. In Jesus' name, we have they die. Say in Jesus' name, we are praying. Listen to the third prayer. Voices from the grave calling my name and that of my family member. Be cancelled, be silent. When they call, we are praying to prayer there. Let it be cancelled, number one, and let it, let their voice be silent. When they call, they are project. It's just like a person. They have released. It may not happen immediately. It may happen in the next one minute, next two minutes, next three minutes. Which, when you bring it from the spirit onto the physical, the one minute, uh, 30 seconds, it may be in the next uh, one year, in the next six months. When we see the manifestation, it's not when they call. They already called some minutes ago. They already called some hours ago. Are you hearing me, ma? Are you hearing me, sir? So now we are going to decree. Any voice from the grave that is calling your name, that is calling the name of your husband, the name of your wife, that is calling the name of your business, any voice from the grave that is calling my name, calling the name of my wife, my children, that is calling this ministry unto death, they should be what? That voice should be cancelled. Whatever they are projecting, it should be cancelled and let them be silent. Are you ready? Say in the name of Jesus, say voices from the grave calling my name and that of my family member. Say in the name of Jesus, you that voice, be cancelled, be silent, 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 be silent, be cancelled, be silent, be cancelled, be silent, be cancelled, be silent, be cancelled, 
be silent. Be counsel. Be silent. Any voice that is calling my name, any voice from the grave calling my children's name, any voice from the grave calling my wife's name, in the name of Jesus, be silent. Be counsel. 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 In Jesus' name, they are counsel. In Jesus' name, they are silent. We take the next one. Every dream, every friction, every prophecy of death against me and my loved one be cancelled. Do you hear that? Are you ready now? Say in the name of Jesus. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say every dream, every friction, every revelation of death against me Against my wife, mention your wife's name, your, your husband's name. Olushola Ariola, mention your children's name, one after the other. Mention the work of your hand, pray in the good network. Say you that dream, you that vision, you that revelation, and its effect. Say be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Be cancelled, be cancelled. Command them to be cancelled. Every dream, every vision of death that is against you, that is against your loved one. That is against the work of your hand and the effect of that dream. Command it to be cancelled in the name of Jesus. You that dream, you that revelation, you that prophecy. In the name of Jesus, you that prediction. Be cancelled. 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 Command them to be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Command them to be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Command them to be cancelled in Jesus' name. They are cancelled. Say arrows of death. Arrows of mistake, arrows of error, arrows of accident. Do you hear that? Mistake and error that will lead to death. Mistake and error that will lead to accident and finally lead to death. I have a revelation some years ago. I was at the hospital monitoring, monitored a child. And the Lord opened my eyes around the, it should be around 6 in the evening. Around 6 in the evening. I was at the entrance, sitting there. there and I saw three balloon. Yes, balloon, you hear me? Balloon. B A W L W O N. Three. They tied them together, and nobody was holding it. It was a live and open vision. And the balloon entered into the world, and I was looking at it. And he entered into that hospital and disappeared. Something about the balloon is this. They wrote something on it. I sent it the balloon. Number one, I saw mistake. Written on one. The second balloon, error. And the third balloon, death. And he entered into that hospital and it disappeared. So I, 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 this is a clear revelation. That means mistake and error. Has already entered to that hospital and it will lead to death. And I was there watching. Hear me, sir. Hear me, man. In the middle of the night, nothing less than nothing less than five children died. Nothing less than five children died. Nothing less than five children. The oxygen, uh, what do you call the oxygen cylinder that they are using to pass? I said, baby's world exploded. That was. Gas exploded and uh, all the mothers, they just picked their children with blood and everything. They are just running away. And where they ran to, the gate of that place was locked. The, the, the entrance was locked. So they have to pass through that place. Nurses and doctors, all of them are run out and say, fire, fire. fire. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. I've seen, you know, I've seen some things in the place of prayer. Arrows of mistake. Arrows of error, arrows of accident, and arrows of death. Fire into my life. Fire into my loved one. In the name of Jesus. When you are praying this prayer, you pray with all, with all your strength. I want to be a fire, 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 fire. Not that it should just disappear. It should go back and prosper in the life of whoever sent it. So that next time they won't send, they will know that you, you are fire, fire. You call, you have God answered by fire. 
So anybody that tamper with you or, or do anything rubbish around you, fire will consume them so that they will leave you. Are you ready? Say in the name of Jesus. Say arrow of mistake, arrows of error, arrows of accident, arrows of paralysis, arrows of death, fire into my life, into my wife, into my children. Say in the name of Jesus. You that arrow, by fire to the sender. In the name of Jesus, by fire, 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 by fire. Command the arrow to by fire. Every arrow of mistake, every arrow of error, every arrow of accident, every arrow of death, every arrow of accident, every arrow of death that will be fire into your life, to the life of your loved one, every arrow of mistake and error that will make them to commit blunder, that will lead to death. Any arrow of accident that will be fire into the life of your loved one or fire into your own life, say in the name of Jesus, you that arrow, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire, by fire. That means you send them back in the name of Jesus. Say backfire, 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 backfire. Command the arrow to backfire in the name of Jesus. Command it to backfire in the name of Jesus. Command it to backfire in the name of Jesus. Command it to backfire in the name of Jesus. Command it to backfire in the name of Jesus. Command it to by fire in the name of Jesus. Command it to by fire. Command it to by fire. Command it to by fire in the name of Jesus. Command it to by fire in the name of Jesus. Command it to by fire in the name of Jesus. Command the arrows of death. Command the arrow of mistake. Command the arrow of error. The arrow of accident. Command it to go back to the sender. In the name of Jesus, you that arrow of error, arrows of mistake, arrows of accident, arrows of death. By fire, 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 by fire. In Jesus' name we are praying. In Jesus' name they by fire. Say spirit of death. Sent to revenge in my life. Do you hear that? Something happened. You know that sometimes you just help somebody, and because you help somebody, they will send the spirit of death. One Wednesday, Wednesday morning, Wednesday morning, it was in my former church there. We were getting ready, me and my wife, almost about 12 years ago now. Do you have, have we have uh, a new day? You are pregnant then. My wife? No. We are in, it was in Baba's house. It was here. So, my, that's almost about 12 years ago now. About 12 years ago. When is the money, me and my wife were getting ready to go to church, midweek uh, service. And somebody, a very close uh, family friend, called me and said, uh, Pastor, Pastor, uh, there's fire on the mountain. If there's no fire on the mountain, is it the valley that you want the fire to be? What is it, my sister? He said, she said her dad, her father is dying right now. Dying, okay? Said, but she know that it's manipulation. I said, okay, are you there? I said, yeah. I said, put the phone, put it on speaker, and put it with your father's ear. Let your father hear. Call him back to life. I just called, I just did my work. You know, my own, that is my assignment. <laughs> My wife left the room when I was praying to the kitchen. Is it kitchen or so? And uh, before you know it, I finished the prayer and uh, I said, that is end. The spirit of death disappear. <laughs> and uh, less than one minute, I was sitting on the bed when, the, when I was praying that prayer. Sitting on that bed, when the spirit of death, I saw it, it entered my room. And before I can say, Jesus... Before I realize, before I say anything, he just entered into my body. Spirit of death sent to revenge. Because they send that spirit to somebody to go and kill that person. So I now stood in between. So they now send it to come and revenge. I said, if you don't, uh, we'll use you there. <laughs> Amen. And that was all. May the Lord God bless my wife in the name of Jesus. But thank God, I'm still alive today, <laughs> to the glory of God. Amen. Say in the name of Jesus, say spirit of death, sent to revenge in my life. Say spirit of death, sent to revenge in the life of my wife, in the life of my children, in the life of my loved one. Say spirit of death, sent to revenge 
in my walk. Say you that spirit, be arrested by fire. In the name of Jesus, be arrested by fire. 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 Spirit of death sent to my life to carry out revenge mission. To carry out revenge mission in the life of my wife, in the life of my children. You that spirit of death, be arrested. 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 Command them to be arrested. In the name of Jesus, command them to be arrested. In the name of Jesus, command them to be arrested. In Jesus' name, we are praying. You are going to pray that prayer again. Spirit of death sent to carry out revenge in my life. It may be that you just help somebody unknown to you. It may be that you just disobey somebody unknown to you. Somebody asked me to come to come and see her some years ago. I went there as I was going, Holy Spirit said, I should not eat. But that person is so dear to me. I went there, they gave me food. I, I, <laughs> and as I was leaving the Holy Spirit said, I asked you not to eat. You ate. You have just eaten poison. You have just eaten poison. I was coming out of the house. And I said, eh? And the person said, look at me. I said, Pastor, what do you say? I said, nothing. Because I, I answer Holy Spirit out. Came back home, prepared communion, I flushed my system, I pray, I cry unto God. And Holy Spirit said, they will call you again. The same person will call you again. Same time next week to come. Where you go? Don't eat. <laughs> so I said, why, should, why you two, why do you go? You need to go now. <laughs> that sometimes you need to just go so that uh, be able to deal with the enemy. I went there. And the moment I entered, I said, ah, pastor, you are welcome. I prepare food. <laughs> I said, I'm not going to eat. Because I'm ready. He said, no, you eat. I said, I'm not ready. He said, you eat. I said, ah, now by force. I said, I'm not eating. Even I'm not going to sit down. You said, I should come and see you. I'm here. So what do you, what is it? I refused to eat and I left. I came back to my house. In the night, they came back. They wake me up. It's not in the dream, oh. They wake me up and they said, how dare you? We gave you food to eat. You said you did not eat. How dare you? Your great, 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 great grandfather. Ba, 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 ba. Yala, yala. You cannot give them food and they will not eat. Please, those of us don't understand you. <laughs> I said, your father. Eh? Your father, father. <laughs> eh? We cannot give them food and they will not eat. Yeah, take and eat. And they gave me the food on the physical. You know? <laughs> on that level, that's nothing you can do. And I took the food, I low, <laughs> and when I finished, they gave me, is it water or something, drink, uh, drink. And when I finished drinking, and they said, hey, next time when we, when we ask you to eat, you take the food from us. I said, yeah, sleep back. As I was going, lying down, going back on the bed to lie down, it's like they put a knife inside my stomach, and they were dragging it, dragging it. And I was weeping, I was crying. That was when my wife woke up. All the time I was eating, my wife did not know that uh, they are serving a uh, husband a uh, delicious meal <laughs> on the same bed. When the pain was too much for me to bear, and I knew that it, it, this one is automatic death, I said, my wife, if I die, it's not ordinary. They just have me food now. But I said, ah, in this room, this midnight, I said, I just ate now. I just ate. I said, oh. I said, you know where I went in the, in the daytime? I said, yes. Uh -huh. So they gave me food there. I did not eat. So they brought the food now. And not in the dream. They wake me up before they say I should eat. I ate. And so my wife quickly prepared communion to flush it. And uh, you know why they were doing that? I was interceding for somebody. I was praying for somebody. And they said I should leave the person. <laughs> leave the person. So when I was injuring them, so they want to just deal with me, so that when they remove me, they will be able to do with that person. Another time, I was I was interceding for another person entirely, another person entirely, and he said, "What is your own business? You did not come from the same place. You, do, you have nothing to do with this person. Leave this person for us." But God said, "I should be a watchman over this person." 
So when God is saying I should be watching this this person, so one power will say I should leave. In our mouth, Joe, one. Amen. Say fire. I can't hear you. Say fire. I want you to shout it loud and clear. Say fire. Say in the name of Jesus. Say spirit of death. Send to revenge in my life, in the life of my children, in the life of my loved one. Say be arrested be, and be disgraced. Be arrested. 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 Be disgraced. Any spirit of death. Every spirit of death sent to carry out revenge mission in my life. Be arrested and be disgraced. 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 Jesus' name we are praying. Please ask, just give me five minutes. Less than ten minutes, I will be done. Please. Please and please. I know our time is up, but please just grant me five to ten minutes. I want us to pray and finish everything. Amen. The next one, you are going to decree. Judgment of death over my head. In their court, they, once they pass that judgment of death, they have set everything in, in under this heaven in motion. Everything in the earth, they have set them in motion. And everything that will be happen to that person will be things that will lead to death. Why? Because in the spirit realm, they have passed judgment of death over the head of that person. Say in the name of Jesus, say judgment of death over my head. Say judgment of death over the head of my wife, the head of my husband, the head of my children. Say judgment of death that I'm carrying about. Say in the name of Jesus, be cancelled, be nullified by the blood of Jesus. Be nullified by the blood of Jesus. Every judgment of death over my life, over my head, over the head of my wife, the head of my children, be cancelled, be nullified, 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 be cancelled, be nullified. In Jesus' name we pray. Say gate of death that opened for me at the grave. Say I command you. Be closed by the blood of Jesus. Are you, do you hear that? Say in the name of Jesus. Say, gate of death. Open for me. That open for my children. That open for my wife. In the grave. Say by the blood of Jesus. By the fire of Holy Ghost. I command you. Close. 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 In Jesus' name, we have decreed. Say in the name of Jesus. Say I reject transfer of death. Death transfer. Say I reject it. In the name of Jesus. Now begin to reject it. That means they will not transfer death on your head. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Niku, Iku, Kiku. You will not die the death of another person. Say in the name of Jesus. Say I reject death transfer. In the name of Jesus. I will not die another man's death. In the name of Jesus. Another person's death. I will not die it. My wife, my children will not die another person's death. In the name of Jesus, begin to reject it. Death transfer. Transfer of death upon your life, upon your marriage, upon your children, upon your loved one. Reject it. Reject it. Reject it. By the blood of Jesus. Reject it. By the fire of Holy Ghost. Reject it. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, my life, you will not be sacrificed on evil altar. My life, the life of my wife, the life of your husband, the life of my children, say you will not be you you will not be sacrificed on satanic altar, on evil altar. In the name of Jesus, why not begin to pray that prayer? Your life, the life of your loved one, the life of your children will not be sacrificed on evil altar. Say you, my life, the life of my wife and children, you will not be sacrificed on any evil altar. In the name of Jesus, you will not be sacrificed on any evil altar. In the name of Jesus, you will not be sacrificed on any evil altar. In the name of Jesus, you will not be sacrificed on any evil altar. In the name of Jesus, my life, you will not be sacrificed on any evil altar. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Please, without without any G-O, any apology. Because many of us, we are just, uh, we are just like a sheep. 
this next prayer, you are going to pray it. All of us are going to pray it. Five minutes non-stop. Then I only have two prayer, two or three prayer after that. But five minutes non-stop. I will time ourselves. We we'll pray it. My life, my blood will not be used to gather crowd. My wife, do you have that prayer? Please, everybody, do you have that prayer? My life. My blood will not be used to gather crowd. I will explain it and we pray it. But if you are not ready to pray it, but I've done my own. There are some church, there are some geo. You are the one that called them pastor. Everyone did not see them as pastor, not to even say they even call them pastor. Because they have ED agenda, there are some things under. But they carry the Bible, they call Jesus. And all of us will believe that they are, they, are, they are men of God. Men of God, unquote and unquote. Every year, life must be used. Life must be, somebody must die in their church. It should be life, everybody die every day. So there's no way you will attach it to them. But unknown to you, unknown to me, unknown to us. There's something underground in their church. That they are using the life every year. A life must just go. And to renew that covenant, to renew that power. Hear me, sir. Hear me, man. I pray for you. Your life, your blood, will not be used to gather crowd in the name of Jesus. There's a marketplace. There's a marketplace. There's a marketplace. Somebody must die inside that market. Once in a year. But because people must die. So when somebody dies, we say, oh, you just die. You know, there's no way that somebody will die and they won't attach it to somebody. Unknown to you. It was time for blood to be donated in that, in that uh, market. And the next person that, uh, the mother, what do they call them? Yaloja. Eh? The priest. The next person that he saw and just speak. Unknown to you. Unknown to you. Say in the name of Jesus. Say my life. My blood. The life of my wife, the blood of my wife, the life of my children, the blood of my children will not be used to gather crowd in the name of Jesus on any satanic altar. My life and my blood, the life and the blood of my wife, the life and the blood of my children will not be used on any satanic altar to gather crowd in the name of Jesus. Our life will not be used. Our blood will not be used to gather crowd. On any satanic altar, in the name of Jesus, my life will not be used, my blood will not be used to gather crowd on any satanic altar, in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, my life will not be used, my blood will not be used to gather crowd on any satanic altar, in the name of Jesus, my life will not be used, my blood will not be used to gather crowd on any satanic altar, in the name of Jesus, my life will not be used, my blood will not be used, my life will not be used, my blood will not be used, in Jesus' name we are praying, in Jesus' name we are praying, say in the name of Jesus, say any grave, dog for me, and for my loved one, say swallow your digger, do you whoever that dig that uh, grave, the grave should swallow the person, are you ready now, say in the name of Jesus, Say by the blood of Jesus. Say by Holy Ghost fire. Say any grave. Dog for me. Say swallow your digger. In the name of Jesus. Swallow your digger. Swallow your digger. Swallow your digger. You that satanic grave. Dog for my life. Dog for my wife. Dog for my children. In the name of Jesus. Swallow your digger. Swallow your digger. Swallow your digger. Swallow your digger. Whoever that have dug you, begin to swallow them. 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 Whoever dug grave for me, for my wife, for my children, in you that grave, swallow the person. Swallow your digger. In the name of Jesus, whoever dug grave for me, enter into that grave. 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 In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say sickness from the grave. Arrow from the grave in my body. Say I shake you off. When you are saying I shake you off, you shake your body. Are you ready? Shake that sickness off, oh. Because you are about to enter into a season of uh, testimonies, your season of breakthrough. So you must not, they must not use sickness to be wasting that resources. So, eh? when, you, when you enter into that breakthrough, 
people must not just another person that did not know where you labor for it must not come and be eating it. And the only thing that they will give you is just three minutes silence. No, now you go, now you walk, now you go chop them. You hear me? I simply means you are the one that walk. Am I right? And you are the one that we eat in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. Say arrows of sickness. Say arrows from the grave. Say arrows of death in my body. Say I shake you off by Holy Ghost fire. I shake you off. I shake you off. I shake you off. I shake you off. Arrow from the grave. Arrows of death in my body. Say I shake you off in the name of Jesus. I hope my wife is praying. Say I shake you off in the name of Jesus. Arrows of death. Arrows from the grave in my body. I shake you off. 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 I shake you off from my body. From the body of my loved one. From the body of my children. Arrows of death. Arrows from grave. Sickness that will lead to death. In the name of Jesus. Sickness from the grave. By Holy Ghost fire. Shake you off. I 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 shake you off. Shake it off now. In the name of Jesus. Shake the arrows off. That sickness in your body. That strange sickness. Shake it off. 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 Jesus name we are praying. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say I receive a new life. In Christ Jesus. Say by Holy Ghost fire, I receive a new life. In Christ Jesus. Say breath of God, come upon my life afresh. Say I receive a new life. I receive the breath of God. In the name of Jesus. Begin to receive the breath of God upon your life, your home, your marriage, your business, your career. Say I receive a new life. By this life, nothing will die. Nothing will die. Nothing will die. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. Jesus' name we are praying. Let's begin to cover ourselves with the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood, the blood, the blood. Cover yourself with the blood of Jesus. Cover your loved one with the blood of Jesus. Cover everything that concerns you with the blood of Jesus. The blood of protection. The blood of defense. The blood of protection. The blood of defense. Cover your life with the blood of Jesus. 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 Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. In Jesus' name, we are praying. I declare, I declare, concerning every one of us, as we are praying tonight, the Lord here answer us in the name of Jesus. Any satanic grave dug for us, dug for our loved one, whoever dug that grave, the grave will swallow the person in the name of Jesus. In your life, in my life, in your marriage, in my marriage, in your work, in my work, affliction will not rise in the name of Jesus. I say affliction will not rise up in the name of Jesus. Any program, any agenda from grave concerning every one of us, heaven cancel it in the name of Jesus. I say heaven cancel it in the name of Jesus. Hello, sir. I declare, I declare concerning you, concerning your wife, concerning your children, you will not die in the name of Jesus. I say you will not die in the name of Jesus. Your blood, your life, your blood, your life will not be used to gather crowd in the name of Jesus. The heart will not swallow your blood. The heart will not swallow the blood of your loved one. The heart will not swallow the blood of your wife. In the name of Jesus, you are all covered with the blood of Jesus. So shall he be. Jesus' name I pray. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. Please, before we go, let's not forget by special grace of God. Today is Saturday. We come back for our uh, restoring family prayer altar 8 p.m. 8 in the night amen on facebook the lord bless us and uh, tomorrow sunday program let's not forget amen our online sunday service by the special grace of god and uh, for the prayer avalanche amen let's get prepared towards it let's prepare our mind let's invite people to join to join on our, on our facebook praise the lord just tell them they just ask for praying ego on uh, facebook they should like it when they like that page anytime we are live Amen. The Facebook will send them notification so that they will know the Lord bless us in the name of Jesus. And also, amen, for those of us whom God is using to support this ministry, this prayer avalanche, we really want to push it. Amen. God has been helping us to enter into a new nations on the social media, through social media before. But this particular one, because God is visiting us, the wind of change is going to blow. Amen. We want to push it more. Amen. We need your support. Amen. Your financial support. 
Amen. As you are sending it in, amen. Just send, just write um, seed towards a uh, prayer avalanche. Seed towards prayer avalanche. May the Lord God bless every one of you in the name of Jesus. I say, may God bless your home. May God bless your marriage. May God bless everything that concerns you. Before, during, and after the prayer avalanche, the wind of change will blow to every area of your life in the name of Jesus. I share something this afternoon during the communion. I say, after Jesus Christ used the boat of Peter, Peter that was stranded in the journey of life, that was nothing. The Bible says his, his net begin to break and his ship begin to sink. Why? Because of avalanche of testimony. You cannot partner with God. You cannot give your money, your seed unto God to use. And uh, God will not amaze and surprise you. I won't say more than that. You cannot do it and God will not reward you. May the Lord God reward every one of you in the name of Jesus. Once again, as you go into this weekend, as you go into the remaining days this month, the remaining days this year, and the remaining days of the rest of your life, death is not permitted in the name of Jesus. Good morning. God bless us in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord.